Yeah, I think the last outing he threw was really good also. The ball has been coming out of his hand really good for probably four outings now. Um, velocity's up, but not just velocity. That It's got life to it, and you can see it. You can see the swings that are being taken. Uh, he's commanding his slider better. He threw some good, two good split fingers today. Uh, so I think he's he's gaining confidence, um, hopefully – uh, to the point where uh, where he was a couple of years ago when we depended on him so much. Ron, what are you thinking uh, tomorrow? Do you, do you have a starter yet or are you going to wait? No, um, uh, Brewer's going to start tomorrow. Uh, so, you know, whether he goes three or more, we just it's the same thing. It's the pitch count with him. I know uh, last time he got the pitch count up pretty high. So hopefully uh, we'll be more efficient there. Uh, he'll attack the zone better. And then, uh, and then Darwinson probably needs to pitch somewhere in there. So whether it's one or two innings, we'll see how he does. Um, but I think those are the two guys that we would like to get in tomorrow, and then we'll fill in the rest uh, depending on what happens with the game. I know you've talked about it before with Mitch's swing kind of almost being perfect for this kind of season. But um, what's impressed you about the way he's been able to kind of stay consistent throughout the entire month you've been playing? Well, I think part of that consistency is the way he's hitting the ball. So he's not just pulling the ball and he gets in a pull mode at times. So uh, he's been hitting the ball all over the field. He's getting base hits the other way. Um, you know, the home runs to center. So uh, I think when he's using the whole field like that, um, and it's also different pitches, it, it's change ups. Um, he's hit some curve balls. He had a good fastball today. Uh, so I think that al allows him really to uh, stay more consistent with his swing. When he starts getting in that full mode, all of a sudden you see um, some up and downs from him. So, uh, you know, I know I know Tim and, and, um, and Pete have been working hard with him to try to keep him consistent. And I think he's uh, really comfortable where he is right now. And uh, it would certainly be great if he uh, can maintain that for the next, you know, uh, hopefully a couple months, but we'll see.